So what you guys can do is realize that if you're getting too hot around the heater, you just pull back a bit and just go and sit back a bit from the heater so you can go and deliver better content. And also, just make sure you understand that with my voice memos, that automatically it says voice underscore 007 or then it goes when I create another nice and beautiful content and then it says voice underscore 008 and then voice underscore 009 and it creates all these files like this and I just upload the file like that online and then I may have fucking 500 files online and then it's all fucking all numbers already for myself and I can say what I can do is I can label the numbers from 0 to 1 or 0 to 100 or 0 to 1000 of these podcasts and I can say yes 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 it's all labeling and I can actually connect the dots and I can connect the names in my voice memos with Mega Drive and I can see the names list and then what I do in the Mega Drive is I title all my nice and beautiful content in different manners but that way I never have to go writing the number duration in terms of the number of my voice memo in terms of the duration of the voice memo I never have to go writing them down anymore in terms of looking in my laptop to see the numbers, to connect the numbers together when I can connect the names together. I just connect the names now together and I just really, really move on very quickly because I understand now that when I really, really grow, I just connect the dots together and that way I'm always delivering content one way or another much quicker. And I'm understanding that now since people can see my content as well and how I do greater, I realize that also what I do is I turn off one of the heaters over here. I turn off one of the actual bars and I'm making sure always that you just go and focus on yourself and what you want out of life and just deliver a content for yourself. I mean, if you want to deliver content in your life, then you're focusing on making sure that you're delivering yourself the best knowledge in the world. And then just love your life, guys. I mean, love your life differently. I mean, just make sure that you're watching something that's helpful in a way that it's images. I mean, watch more images about life and you'll be successful right away. So the whole point is stunning upon your life in a way that you're learning quickly, I love I. Or actually the whole point is making sure that you understand straight away upon how people can view you in terms of life when you have all this music coming up. So as you have music coming up, you're just enjoying your life and you're making sure that no matter what, that you're learning very quickly upon how people are treating you and how people can see your content and what you're doing. Of course, it's nice and beautiful when you're giving people an experience upon life and what's happening around the world. So as people can always see exactly what you're doing about life and they can see exactly what you did place in the track in terms of your life and it's very exciting so it's much more how I feel I have this vibe going around my music but because I have vibes in life I realize it's because I create them I create these vibes around I because I love I Russian now because I'm always delivering the best quality of everything I need in life I'm always following my heart I'm following what I need to do today to make sure I have success so I actually always in terms of life I'm focusing on a greater way of life for myself to deliver something that's actually quality in a way that I'm moving forward I'm spinning spider webs of wisdom ar around town everywhere I'm making sure that no matter what that since I'm actually talking more I'm learning very quickly upon how it is to succeed and that's how I actually grow I grow myself differently and I focus upon understanding straight away to just live my life differently and I focus upon understanding that with SoundCloud, I never need SoundCloud. I never need SoundCloud. I just put everything on YouTube. And that's how it is. I promise you now on SoundCloud, I can place stuff on SoundCloud here and there. I love it. I promise you, although it's much more how I feel, I promise you SoundCloud never gives me what I need. And it's much more how I feel. I promise you, although it gives me a, that kind of audio quality and all that in terms of life, but either way, I promise you, some people do listen on SoundCloud. So I'm making sure anyway that what's important for myself is just to be greater and understand Jesus Christ goes with just YouTube. I promise you Jesus Christ just with goes with YouTube over here. And I understand that with Spotify, I promise you Jesus Christ says that you can do some Spotify if you want. Or I can place my music on Spotify. But with Spotify, I understand it's coming up, but there's a long way to go with Spotify. <laughs> so I just want to be able to go around the world first and travel and make it happen first. And then you can go up into the nice and beautiful Spotify because I feel anyway that what's happening around my content over here is I'm understanding that no matter what, that everything's for free. I'm actually understanding that no matter what, that I want to <coughs> I want to deliver content quick. I want to make sure anyway that what I want to do is just quickly just be able to read and read and read and read and understand that no matter what, that if I give it a go, I promise you it's much more how I feel. I feel 
I'm going to have a tendency to just go and do it because I understand that no matter what, I never want to lag. I never want to lag anything, man. I make sure that no matter what, that it's much more quicker for myself to just go and do it because I just go and use my own internet over here. And I make sure that no matter what, that I'm just much faster able to watch my videos, man. I mean, so much quicker. I mean, you know understand? So the whole point is just focus upon studying yourself in a way that you're learning quickly upon the art of what you need to do. And you're making sure that you're learning quick upon understanding that people go around playing your music and they see exactly how good your quality of audio is. And that way you're learning very quickly upon what you need to do to succeed. I promise you all the time, I'm focusing on visiting a better way. I'm, up, I'm always uploading YouTube content online where it's always MP3 files. I'm always uploading MP3 files online. And that way I succeed much greater because... I have a greater life, I'm focusing on something that's helping me grow, and that way I'm doing life greater. So I'm understanding that no matter what, I have nothing to lose, because I'm somebody successful, I'm somebody who understands life much more, I love I. Right now, because I understand life much more, I'm understanding what I need to do to succeed differently, is just make sure I'm doing something different all the time. But I'm understanding that no matter what that, I see Netflix is taking a long time to load. So why is that? Right it's because of the internet. Now, am I blaming the internet? Probably it's because of I, I you, and nothing else. I you, I'm just doing my best to try to watch these images very quickly, but it's just how I understand that no matter what, it needs to start up in a way that it's working now. So I'm focusing on understanding that no matter what, I want to just focus upon loving myself in a way that I'm learning very quickly upon the art of persuasion of being able to stand up in front of a crowd and speak and speak and speak and speak. And that way I'm understanding that no matter what, I'll just upload all my content on my own. I upload all my content while I'm doing Netflix. And I just enjoy. Or actually, it's nice and beautiful, isn't it? I mean, you can enjoy yourself and you can watch Netflix while you're uploading your content. It's very beautiful. So all the time, I'm always focusing on shifting my behavior. And making sure I have more than enough of everything I need to succeed. So I'm always delivering content. And as I deliver content, I focus on different areas of life and I focus on making sure that I have new aspects of life over here where people are saying something about me where it's good and I'm understanding that no matter what that I just focus upon lifting my area of courage and as I lift my courage I understand that worlds apart difference between my music and other people's music and how we're just different and we have different styles of music and that's the whole point I realize when you make your own music or actually then you become something of a new artist that you have your own style of music and how you make music. And that's the whole point. I mean, the whole point is something different. I mean, do something different. And as you do something different, you're learning very quickly upon how to grow because that's how I feel. I feel I'm inspiring somebody out there. I'm inspiring somebody to come and see me live somewhere because that way I grow very quickly upon what I need to do. And people can see how much I'm successful over here in my clubs and what I'm doing. So... They can actually feel the vibe of my music and what's happening. And it's, I die shall never kill. And I understand that one there. But I'm understanding either way that I can feel that they can really, really pull the trigger over here and say, hey, it's an excellent track and they want to hear it at the nightclub somewhere. And I can feel, I can feel the vibe that they really, really bring to the table. And I can see straight away how I feel about playing that track live somewhere. Because that way I understand that no matter what that, it's much more how I feel that I just do a great job. I love it. Now, because I'm understanding that no matter what, that it's so fun that I feel people are talking about festivals around town. And they're saying, this guy can go and do a festival with just that one set. <laughs> I mean, in a sense, I love I. Now, because I'm understanding that no matter what, that my music is one hour long, I can do festivals around town. I can do whatever it is. I can just go and grow myself. But as I grow myself, I understand that no matter what, I'm learning very quickly upon my life in different ways I'm making sure that I'm doing composing in different ways of life to make sure that I have a nice and beautiful composition of whatever I want I'm understanding straight away how I can see straight away the code of honor in terms of music production I can see straight away the code of honor of music production I can see the code of honor of music production and music producers and how they say something about music and how they talk in music language around electronic music and I can see exactly what they're talking about I can see exactly what the musicians are talking about in terms of their music. And now the musicians who are just, 
that classical musicianal type where they just play an instrument live. Or should they are more melodies in a way that they are looking to help themselves to create their own melodies, but they never speak about that much. Or as I love it. I mean, why is that? Because they feel that they are never good enough to make their own melodies. I promise you. So what they do is they go and practice other people's melodies. I mean, why? I mean, why do you go? And practice, I mean, why do you practice other people's melodies, man? I mean, why not just go and create your own melodies? I mean, I mean, in a sense, so I understand my biological dad grew up with people and musicians around town who play other people's music, and that's why they're failing. Because I never play other people's music. I play my music. <laughs> I play my music. <laughs> I mean, why? I mean, what for? I mean, why do you want to play other people's music for? I mean, play something that you create instead. I mean, understand? I mean, that's the whole point. Yeah. So. As you succeed, you're learning very quickly upon dwelling upon something that's actually helping you succeed. And you're learning much more about how people are dwelling upon something that they need to do. So as you really, really dwell upon something that's really helping you move forward, then it's much more how you have to feel your life actually doing greater. I love I. Prosha, as I do greater, I promise you people can actually see you're making episodes or a thousand episodes over here. And they can see the excitement in the air. I mean, they can see, oh, I mean, this guy is going for a thousand hours of music over here, man. I mean, anyway, so what I'm doing all the time is I'm saying that they can see that there is another track coming up. So I'm making sure, anyway, that they can always catch up to me in terms of how I'm making music. So it's actually very exciting because I can just imagine somebody starting off like I am. I mean, I can already see this guy is coming up in a way. I'm like, I can only see, for example, from another perspective, that if I have to look at this guy in terms of music, then in terms of myself, if I have to look at myself from another person's perspective, in terms of what I see, I promise you, I see something that this guy is really, really honest about himself, but he's actually really good. I promise you, he's really good about his music. I, I promise you, from another point, I promise you, from another point of view, I can see straight away. Mm, I can understand he's actually doing nice and beautiful content here. And I can say straight away that he's actually learning the art of trance music. And he's such a great composition artist, I can see it. And now, straight away I can see that no matter what, that this individual has far more going for him than just music production. And I can see straight away that he's a fashion model, and I'll be like, whoa, I mean, he's fashion modeling? I mean, wow, I mean, those photos that he does is amazing. And I understand anyway, that since I can see that, I can actually idea it, and I can be able to see exactly what I can do. And then I understand anyway that when they see my YouTube channel in terms of life and they say, oh, I can see his YouTube channel and I can see, oh, I mean, he's actually doing life coaching too. So he has something else on the side, but he's doing the overall picture over here and he's showing me something about Mega Drive and this Mega Drive over here, I understand straight away that here is where in terms of many people start to fail about my Mega Drive and they never ever consider Mega Drive. And anyway, the, I realized straight away that this individual straight away has a lot of success. I promise you, and now, anyway, I'll just move on all the way. Gosh, that's how it is. I promise you, although, that people can really, really start to really, really dwell upon understanding myself and how I'm actually doing content and what I'm doing around my life daily. So, as I succeed, I focus upon understanding that I want to be able to see the nice and beautiful episode over here. So, it's season two, episode something. And now, I went season two over here. I have to see the actual season two before I escape the plan. So it's season two, episode four, for example. And I understand I want to see the episode line with the season before I actually skip over the project to see something new, to do something new for myself over here. So I never skip anything, but I make sure to see the episode two or any kind of episode with the season number so I can always reference it to be able to watch it when I need to, and I do a screenshot, and I understand I do a screenshot that I'm watching this series, so I understand that I can go back into Netflix and search it up and continue my series whenever I want, so no matter what, that's the whole point, I'm doing something quickly, I'm making sure I'm quick and enabling myself to succeed differently, and I'm making sure I'm learning quickly about the art of what I need to do, so the whole point is making sure that no matter what, I understand that some people, in terms of some people want me to remix their music, I lie. I mean, they want to give me a promotion is what that is, a brochure. And because I understand anyway that I'm delivering content in regards to what's going on, I'm making sure that no matter what, I can feel, I can feel the vibes over here. I can feel somebody saying nightclub, man. I mean, he's going to nightclubs, I can promise you. 
Roshi, I, can, I, I see it's the Sunset Brothers. Of Roshi, they feel my attention now. Of Roshi, they feel this man is about to go in my clubs. Of Roshi, he's about to. <laughs> in a sense, so that way I'm understanding it's them who's saying that. But then other people are saying it too. I'm making sure anyway that what I want to do is I focus on just making sure that people understand my journey and other people understand how far I've come in music production alone. And they see, I promise you, it snaps on them. And I promise you, it snaps on them in a way that they become bewildering in terms of, they become bewildering in a way that they're never in bewildering type of moments, but they're just aware of much more about me. And they're aware and they're saying, oh, I mean, he's really, really, actually, I mean, actually, he's really, really moving forward and he's moving forward more than me in this. Or she's doing greater. Or she, and then, it do, I mean, it starts to dawn on them about my music and how I'm actually doing. And then it starts to interest them even more about how I'm actually loving my life completely and how I'm doing my life. So as I do my life, I understand that no matter what, that I focus upon doing something greater. So as I do something greater, that no matter what I do, I'm focusing on understanding that as people understand that they're just in the beginning of my series and they understand something's coming up and something's happening with Danny Milovoyevich. So that's yet to come, but no matter what, that I'm always delivering contents regardless. And since I'm, or since I'm always delivering content regardless, I'm always planning my life to be able to suss out exactly what's going on. So as I suss out different aspects of life differently, I make sure I'm always that individual who understands what's going on about life. So I'm understanding that no matter what, that I'm always learning different arts and different materials and different ways of doing something so I can focus upon understanding how I need to rap as well. I need to go and do a rapping module as well. And now with that, approach, it's much more how I feel where I have to go and just express myself differently and I have to export my music as well. So I understand that no matter what that, since I'm actually doing content right here, I'm actually understanding that I just can go over there to see is my content exporting very quickly. So I understand that I can go and make a 16 gigabyte WAV file from the actual nice and beautiful 32 gigabyte in terms of the 32-bit WAV file, I can make a 16-bit WAV file. So that way I'm always learning quickly upon what I'm doing. But I understand that Sunset Brothers are somebody who has to listen to my track. I probably have to listen. I love I probably have to revise what I'm doing. So I have to go and see exactly what I'm doing so that they can also feel upon something about what they can do. So I'm understanding, I'm giving people ideas quickly upon my life over here. So I'm actually always understanding that now I understand that this nice and beautiful content has done the uploading. But where is it now? Or else that's the thing, huh? I mean, it says it's uploading, but where is it? Or else now, because I'm understanding that no matter what, then my content over here, in terms of my music production, or else that I'm exporting a file, but where is it now? Actually, that's the thing. I want to be able to find the file over here. So as I look at the file name, I'm making sure that I have more than enough to be able to succeed over here by making sure that I can go and find it, for example. So when I say, I just want to say Idonotopia. I mean, Idonotopia is somewhere over here. So I want to say it's in documents somewhere. I mean, I want to be able to find this kind of file over here to see what exactly is this kind of file. So as I actually open up my software over here, I'm making sure that, no, nope, that's a nice and beautiful way to say that it's much more how I feel. And how I feel is that I need to go and promote my name. And as I promote my name, I'm feeling that no matter what, that if this never exports, then why? I mean, why? I mean, make sure you understand that MP3 over here is more enough for me in terms of life. I realize now, why is MP3 more enough for me? Probably just the way it is, isn't it? Probably now, I understand that no matter what, that what I want to do is I want to make sure that I'm learning very quickly upon what I'm doing. So I want to be able to open this project over here. And I just understand that I do realize this, that I'm always traveling in a better way and function. I want to understand Idonotopia soundtrack. I want to make sure that I can find this package over here. Because now I see over here is on the actual, let's say, I realize it's working. Well, that's working, but that's something different, isn't it? I make sure always to just go and rename this nice and beautiful content differently. So what I want to do is I want to make sure that you guys can understand what I'm doing. So as I succeed, I'm learning very quickly 
upon making sure that my content here over here is delivering its product so I want to be making sure that I can go and open my products over here and understand anyway I want to be able to open my beautiful track over here so what I do is I just go and open it in a different file over here I realize my FL Studio is actually loading in a way it's loading and I understand anyway that it's just gone from the picture so what I need to do is open up the project in another realm and lucky I did save it I did save the project and now what I want to do is I want to go into the master file over here I want to open Idonotopia package over here I just want to open the file over here I mean, as I open this file over here I want to make sure I extract the actual file and as I extract the file I want to be able to make the file come true Probably now here it is although now the synth pitch is gone from the actual occasion so what I need to do is I need to open the file differently I have to make sure I put the synth pitch over here inside of the file so I can focus on understanding why that is or I need to find out I need to find out why is my FL Studio never exporting the WAV file I I have to find out so I understand anyway but what I do is I just go and grab my actual synth file over here and make sure that I go and do something greater for myself and I make sure I'm just doing a greater job for myself in different ways to focus upon something that is nice and beautiful so as I really train myself to go and make more music I make sure that no matter what I'm learning very quickly how I can inspire somebody very quickly to go and make long music happen but if they are really really willing to then it's much more how it is it's much more how I feel there's just that kind of tug of war going on but a little bit that way it's much more how I feel that other people have to catch up to me anyway so making sure that no matter what that I realize it's much more about succeeding all together and it's never just about music but it's more about life coaching too it's more about something else but if they never have the courage to do it then you can never stop them or you can never stop people who never want to improve I mean, understand, but you never want to stop them. I mean, you just want to make sure that you can go and do a greater life for yourself in ways that's helping you grow, and you're making sure that you're lifting yourself in communicational skills all the time to understand why that is. I mean, understand if you're doing something to help yourself to succeed, and you're trying to locate your files, and you're trying to understand exactly what you need to do all the time to be able to love your life, and to be able to go and do life greater all the time then you're always understanding that no matter what you deserve exactly what you came for I mean what you came for is what you deserve so I understand that my music in terms of my FLP files do upload and they do export themselves from one hour but I've never done the exporting of a WAV file at 101 minutes but guess what I promise you now if I just go and do greater over here I may have done that so over here it's 140 minutes so it's all working I mean, it's all working nice and clearly so I'm just making sure that I can go and dwell upon understanding that it's just that kind of file isn't it I have to make sure that I'm saving the file differently I have to make a different name I just make a, the name 1 I make it a name I put the name I 32 bit and let it be that way well, since I'm actually doing this now, I'm making sure that no matter what, I can go and just deliver much more content in terms of life. I'm making sure I'm uploading my content over here. And as I upload my content, I just go and deliver and I sit over here and I just relax. Because what's important for me is delivering a better content fuel production. And I want to make sure that I see the nice and beautiful season list before I do anything else about life and I'm making sure I'm always holding my phones so I'm actually always doing greater so I can go and do something more so I'm making sure that no matter what I want to be able to go and express myself much more so I'm understanding that it's a blessing to be able to talk to you and to be able to understand that somebody's always listening to me and that somebody's always out there who understands me and that way I understand that no matter what I'm learning very quickly upon how to go and deliver content so 
as I deliver content, I want to be making sure that my content is heard. I'm making sure I'm always holding my phones with both hands, unless it's on the selfie stick. And I make sure anyway that what I do is different. So I'm making sure always to go and study upon what I'm doing over here so I can actually understand something about life over here. I want to make sure to understand that. I want to create a 32-bit WAV file. I want to create this WAV file. But I'm understanding that it's a different name over here. And because it's a different name, I want to make sure that I have everything in life to succeed with over here. So I'm making sure that I go to the nice and beautiful where I brush it small how I go desktop. I make sure I save everything desktop over here. I make sure that no matter what, I go and just place I. I say I 32 bit. I say I dash 32 bit. I realize now that's in desktop. I realize it's going to desktop as a WAV file. I make sure it's a WAV file. And that may be the reason. And then I just make it a 32 bit WAV file. And that's it. I mean, what else is there? Over here, I go and start the package. I go and export that. I want to see now it's definitely going into my desktop. So, anyway, I just continue my project over here, which is uploading. I love I. I'm uploading my content. So, as I upload content, I'll just go and do greater in terms of my communicational work over here to make sure I have more wisdom. I love I. I promise you, although if other people want to see me, then they can see me. I mean, I promise you they can come in to see me. But they have to give me money to see me, and I promise you, that's the only way they can see me. I promise you, that way I'm understanding that no matter what I do, I'm always understanding how to love you in a way that I'm learning in terms of life. To go and do greater upon what I'm doing. So that's the whole point for me, to be able to deliver something that's nice and beautiful, always. Because that's how it is. I mean, how it is, I understand, is looking for a greater way. So I'm understanding that, yes, I want to be able to just go and dwell upon understanding to just use my internet over here to be able to go and do what I need to do. And I focus upon understanding that, yes, I realize I feel how it is being a better individual upon what you need to do. But I'm never sitting on that couch again. Russia, I, I have my bolt to that couch over here. Russia, I never want to sit on it because it's 16 years old and more. I'm never old. Because I love I, I promise you, every single day I'm focusing on delivering and understanding that I'm never old, but I'm understanding that is I love I. I promise you, it's much more how that couch is over 16 years old and has broken down completely in a way that it's bearable to sit on it. I mean, it's so bearable. And as soon as you sit on it, then your back starts hurting because of how the couch is. I mean, in a sense, so I never want to sit on that couch. I'm pretty sure that now, what I want to do is just Netflix. I just want to go and entertain myself. And as I entertain myself, I focus upon different aspects of life. I focus on doing something different. And I lay down while I'm doing Netflix. And I just go and do this all day. I do this all day long. I mean, that's end because why? I realize because I need to be growing myself in different ways. I need to be making sure that you guys have content every single day. To go and be better and better and better. So what I do is I lay down and I just relax. I just go and enjoy myself. I can talk to anybody I want. And I can just enjoy myself in terms of what I'm doing. And that's the whole point, guys. I mean, the whole point is making sure that if you have no dashboard, in terms of nothing loading on the process of your dashboard in your phone screens, then understand to go into Mega Drive and see the dashboard of the transfer button and what's happening. And that way... You can update yourself with content around you and you can see exactly what's completing and what's happening around your music and what's happening around your life. And that way you're just uploading content and you're going on Netflix and you enjoy yourself and that's the whole point, yeah? I mean, the whole point is making sure that you are more successful than yesterday and you're just learning. I mean, learn to go and dwell upon doing as much content as you can daily. I mean, watch other people as much as you want, but just be doing content. And that's how Jesus Christ does it. Russia, what I do now is I'm always looking for better ways to dwell upon life. I'm understanding that no matter what. And now since my nice and beautiful life is getting ahead of me, 
I'm not saying that it's because I'm talking the words. I'm talking words to make sure that I'm very successful upon life. And I can understand exactly what's going on in a nice and beautiful film, such as The Good Doctor, for example. And I'm going to state straight away upon how I need to go and dwell to see exactly what storyline or where I'm up to in the series by making a screenshot every time I have to, let's say, if you have to go and, let's say, exit Netflix, then have a screenshot of Netflix to see exactly where you are, and that's it. I mean, make sure you do that before you do anything else because that way you're ahead of the content and you're ahead of the people and you're making sure that you're studying the game of what you need to do to succeed. And that way you're learning much more quicker and quicker upon life. And you're just doing greater of a job for yourself to succeed and you're making sure that you're learning what you need to do. And that way you're enjoying and that way you're making people feel amazing because you have great music. And I understand Armin Van Buren makes me feel amazing and so does Will Sparks with the music, I promise you. Roshi Mala also helps me to feel amazing about their music. Roshi, now with Sunset Brothers, I promise you it's more that I'm feeling it track. Roshi, they make me feel amazing, but also with the donk and energy, they make me feel amazing. And I'm making sure that no matter what, you understand straight away how I feel about people who make me feel great. And that's how I feel that Jesus Christ makes me feel great about life. I mean, definitely, because of the words and what the Bible is or the story and everything. In terms of what was said, it makes me feel great. And it feels like somebody is looking over me in a way that is giving me storylines of, A, that there is a better world. And it's like I'm a baby. I'm a baby and something's telling me, A, this is just one part of the story. <laughs> I mean, in a sense, I feel great, yeah? So that's how it is. I make sure always to focus upon understanding that when I grow myself, I grow my heart, I grow my communicational skills. Because when I grow my communicational skills, I have a bigger heart. Because the word you say is your heart. And where your words go is where your life goes. I mean, you may have heard that before. But make sure you understand that it comes in many formats. And make sure you understand that what you think is what you are. And what you say is what you do. And what you feel is what you say. And what you say is what you feel. And what you say is your word. I mean, your word is God in the word of I only. When the word of life is the word I, and the word God is the word I. I mean, in a sense, so if you're able to just always dwell upon making sure that the world starts with I and ends with I, then you understand straight away how to talk and how to feel your way throughout life, and you're making sure always that you're learning very quickly upon what's going on around the world, and you're making sure that you're just dwelling upon a better way for yourself is what we're talking about. I mean, for myself now, I'm understanding my strong voice is much better. And I'm understanding that no matter what, that I have a deeper voice than before. So I'm making sure that no matter what, that now, I just want to be growing myself differently. I want to make sure that my everything is much better. And I'm making sure that no matter what, that I learn very quickly upon how to tackle certain aspects of life to make sure I'm very different upon what I'm saying and what I'm doing. Because better communicational skills, in terms of because better communicational skills is something that you need to follow upon in daily life to have much greater of a life for yourself to focus upon succeeding daily to understand straight away upon how you need to grow. So as you grow, you're making sure that no matter what, that you're learning very quickly upon how to never stop at images. I mean, never stop to see anything other than just making sure you're growing. And just make sure you're stopping to see something that is actually something new only. So go and follow the new road of life. I mean, follow and make sure that you're understanding how to go and dwell upon the nice and beautiful way of life. So as you grow, you're succeeding. And you're making sure that no matter what, that you have more courage in yourself because you're doing something that's nice and beautiful for yourself. So I'm only the word I. I'm making sure that no matter what, I'm learning very quickly upon how people can appear beautiful and how people are. So I'm understanding that no matter what, that many people find themselves on acting shows, I love I. Of they have much more credit than, let's say, than they give. But I'm making sure that no matter what, that it's much more how it is. And as soon as you place yourself as an actor or a TV star or something, then people understand you as that all your life.
So you understand straight away that you must understand to always promote those people as much as you can. But make sure you understand that is how it is. I promise you, it's much more how you need to dwell better, to focus upon calling yourself something as well, so that people can understand who you are. I promise you now, when people see me, I promise you people see the word I. I promise you people see I only. I promise you I am who I am. I am just doing greater anyway. But I'm making sure, when I'm making sure my nice and beautiful content is loving I, and I'm making sure all the time I'm focusing on <coughs> dwelling better upon what I'm doing, and I'm making sure I'm learning quickly upon dwelling a different way, in terms of a different way of life where I understand straight away how I can actually dwell upon something that's new. So as I grow differently, I'm making sure I'm always learning something new about life, I'm making sure everything's equal. I'm making sure every single day I learn the art of persuasion. And that's how you grow. I mean, you grow through different ways. And the whole point is making sure that you're learning how to grow. I mean, learn how to grow quickly. I mean, learn how to be much more than what you are. So if you understand straight away how people find you attractive because you're something much more than other people, then focus upon understanding that it's because you are promoting yourself and you have something to promote and it's because of that and every single time that i do something to succeed i'm making sure i'm up to season three over here i'm making sure that something in my life is saying hey i mean people are finding you attractive man i mean I understand because why i realize because i'm doing something to find myself attractive and that's it i promise you every single time i do something to succeed i'm making sure that no matter what i'm learning very quickly upon doing something to help myself with my life and I'm focusing on giving people my content and who I am but it looks great I promise you it looks great when people have this image of me I promise you people have this image of me saying this nice and beautiful content of life and I'm focusing on having a nice and beautiful time with myself or I'm learning very much more because of much more greatness upon what's happening in terms of life and as I focus upon something that's really really helping me to grow myself i focus upon loving myself in a way that i'm dwelling upon a greater way so as i dwell upon a greater way for myself i'm focusing on making sure i reply to people with just a good thumbs up i'm making sure i deliver content in different ways and that way i'm studying i'm studying the art of whatever it is to grow myself so that way i'm learning always to just be greater and greater and greater so as i do greater i'm feeling greater always i'm making sure i always have more to give i'm making sure i'm looking great upon what i'm doing and that way i always have more and as i have more i go and study i study something like jesus christ i study what i need for success i study different aspects of life differently and i'm making sure that no matter what i do i just go and promote myself daily with different aspects <coughs> I mean, make sure you're never getting sick. I'm understanding now I can feel myself just doing greater. I'm making sure that I had some hairs or something that was going in my mouth for some reason. It was making me cough, for example. So it's much more how there's something in the air around here. Or else it might be dust particles or something that's making me cough. I mean, do you understand? I mean, when you're breathing some kind of dust or something, and it goes in your mouth and it goes in your throat. And dust goes in your throat, and you feel like coughing. So maybe that. So I'm understanding that no matter what I do now, I'm lifting people. I'm lifting fast and appropriately to be able to go and just study upon whatever is happening in life. So as I understand that other people want to be trippy and heavy about life, so I just go and do greater anyway. So what I do always is I study upon loving my life and as I love my life I focus upon something that's helping me grow. I well, realize anything that helps you grow today it must be your life and it must be something that's life coaching. And as you life coach you succeed much more than other people. And that way you're doing far greater than other people because you're willing to improve yourself. So always check to see do you have a dashboard happening in your nice and beautiful phone screen because if there's a dashboard screen happening then you're actually doing much greater about your life but once you leave the netflix application 
then it also leaves the actual film series that you're watching. So I just understand that now. So I'm learning very quickly upon technology and applying it very quickly and giving it very quickly in an audio program. So I'm understanding that what I'm doing here is I'm teaching myself all day long what to do and what to do and what to do. And that's why I have my nice and beautiful content going over here, which is my word I. Because I understand my word I is everything. And now if you put it like that, then you can speak whatever you want. As long as you come back to the word I is how you start the sentence. So start with the sentence after the question with the word I anyway. You just understand I know my word I only. And that way I understand that no matter what, that I'm really delivering much more content to be able to succeed differently. So the whole point is making sure that I'm teaching myself in regards to what's going on every single day. I'm talking and talking and talking and talking. And I'm teaching myself slowly upon life itself, upon how people are treating me and how people view me in life. Because what's important for me is I understand that if people block you, then they believe that you've done something to hurt them. I mean, Sam, I love my approach you. It's because when I block people, it's more because I understand that I never need them in my life. And that's what they're saying too. Brush, that's it. I never need you in my life if you block me too. Brush, and that's it. Brush, you. And no matter what I do, I'm always understanding that I have a better career than them. I have a better status than them in life. I mean, who are they to block me when I have greater status than them? I mean, I mean in a sense, so what I realize is I'm always delivering content anyway. I'm making sure I always deliver something that's happening around my life. We're well, making sure that if you understand anything about life, then focusing on helping yourself to succeed is the best kind of individuality that you can give yourself. So just focus on your love for yourself all day long and just focus on understanding that you have to go and do whatever it is that you want to do to succeed daily and then just focus on your love for yourself is what I'm saying. And you have to understand straight away that time is flying and time is going quickly. So you have to be giving people contents quickly upon life so you can succeed quickly. And that's it, Rosh. All you have to do all the time is make sure always that you have always people coming up to you because you're much more popular and that way you're understanding that no matter what, I have Instagram over here. And I'm always checking my Instagram daily to see exactly who is coming to see my content and who is actually coming to see me daily because I have so much more to give. I have so much more success every single day, so I focus on giving that content daily, and I make sure that no matter what, I feel fatigue as well, I feel that no matter what, I can feel my always, in terms of my life, where I'm always learning quickly upon my love for I, and I'm always checking everything is the word I, so as I grow myself, I succeed in different ways, I'm focusing on helping myself to elaborate upon what's happening, so what I do is I'm always understanding straight away how people are. And I can actually go to the Mill Hotel over here. And as I go to the Mill Hotel, I can say straight away how people are promoting themselves like this. But guess what? For it's more how I promote myself a better way. But the better way is understanding that no matter what, they understand straight away how I can mix it up inside of my Instagram channel. And understand no matter what, it's much better that I just go and do so. In a way that I'm promoting my content and what I'm doing in daily life and as I go and promote myself I'm promoting the nice and beautiful way of life over here where I can go and post content into the Mill Hotel or I can go to the Mill Hotel over here and be able to make something on the side over here as well I just say the Mill Hotel and I just say Australian events so I'm always picking up ideas where the Sunset Brothers are going and understand that hotel there, approach it's something, let's say, very small, approach it's a small crowd. I mean, I'm saying, approach now the asylum is something better. Approach the asylum is something more where I can go. And the scary canary is very small. Approach the scary canary is like the Mill Hotel. I mean, it's very similar. I mean, it's very small. And it's a small venue, but yes, your music is going off. I promise you, although, yes, you make money at the door, but it's never about the money. I mean, you're making money always. And never block yourself here. I mean, never block yourself. I mean, make sure you understand that it's more about giving content. So if you want to go and play all, all these places, then go. But Maki is more the asylum. And why is that? Because Maki is much more width. In, there's much more width in it. And there's much more going on here. So I understand anyway, it's much more like that. I approach your home, the venue is much more like Maki. Approach your cans over there is much more like Maki. I can feel it. I'm not sure, although it's much more bigger and there's much more happening, but 
the best kind of venue in Australia right now is Home Bar. I mean, Home Bar is the best venue. I mean, why? Because it's so much more bigger in space and there's so much more happening. And that's why. I mean, Home Bar in Australia is the best one so far. But also Crown Casino has a great venue over there. <clears throat> Arosha, although Crown Casino is something different, but if you have to measure them up together, Arosha, I can say that no matter what, I feel straight away that Home Bar is much more. And now, is Home Bar really much more than Crown Casino? Arosha, it's much more how I feel. I can feel it. I can feel it's much more of a greater venue overall. And now, yeah, Arosha, overall, yeah, but as an arena, Arosha, then I can say as an arena over here, I can say it's much more different, isn't it? Arosha, it's much more how I feel. I feel the Crown Casino has a great classy kind of thing. I promise you, Home Bar is more trash <laughs> with everything that's happening. But the speakers and everything, I promise you, I have to test out everything. I promise you, Crown Casino much more looks like a venue that you want to be at where you can go and produce music. But as a venue, I promise you, as a venue, I promise you, if you have to pick Marky or Crown Casino, I promise you, more Marky, I promise you, Marky, I can feel it. I can feel marquee is much more somewhere where you want to be. And why is it marquee? Because marquee is something much more in your face. I can feel it. And I understand now the different types of nice and beautiful venues. So if I have to say the venues around town, or if I have to pick the venue between home bar and marquee, or should I go home bar? I'll go home bar. And probably between home bar and Crown Casino, I'll go Crown Casino. I go Crown Casino. Approach Crown Casino has a better venue, and why is that? Approach it's, approach it's a new way over there. I understand straight away. And what's better than Crown Casino in Australia? Approach it's the best venue over there. Approach it's the best venue in Australia. Russia, I can say hands down. I can say hands down that between Marquee and Crown Casino, I can say now between these two, I have to say Crown Casino. I have to say Crown Casino is much better. And it's just a nice and beautiful way of the venue. It's much bigger in width and everything for your contents to just upload and for you to pump your music. But it's very different. I promise you, I see the vibes over here. I can see the vibe is much better. I mean, where though? I can see it's in Crown Casino. I can see Crown Casino. I can see it's much more marquee as a greater venue for that kind of sound that you're looking for. But I understand although the venue is what we're talking about. Whereas the venue is Crown Casino, but the kind of uns uns kind of thing, then Marquee in Australia is the best one. Roshi Marquee in Australia is the best one then. Whereas although, yes, Roshi Marquee is the best one in Australia where you want to be as a music producer. And then out of the North Dorf events in Crown Casino or Home Bar, Roshi, go to Crown Casino. Roshi over there is much better. Roshi, and then understand from that point, you just. Go your own way and just go differently. And I'm understanding that over there in the Canberra club events, I promise you, it's more like, let's say, more like Marquee over there. So I'm understanding that no matter what, I want to go and dwell upon really quickly. Understanding that no matter what I see, for example, with my door sales and everything, I promise you, for me to go to the Mill Hotel, I promise you, no. I promise you, over there, I feel that I have to promote myself somehow. And I understand that no matter what, that it's much more how I feel. That they do have a crowd over there, but it's much more how I feel that no matter what's happening over here, I can see people for only two days over there. So they can have a second show as well. So I'm learning something different about the Mill Hotel. So since that's the case, for sure it's more a shop show. It's I mean it's more of a show where you just show up on the day. And that's it. For sure now, you can do your own promotion and you have to do your own promotions around whatever you're doing. But then just make sure that you understand straight away that with Sunset Brothers, I promise you that they are more show up on the day. And that's it. I can feel it. I can feel it. I make sure always that for myself, I go and promote my events at the Mill Hotel or whatever. And yes, I go and make my events right away, just this way, where I get my business cards and I say, hey, you can find me over here, you can find me, or else you can find me over here and over here and over here. And I just go and create my events this way and I post one business card where people can find me and boom, 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 boom. And I just go and go and go and go. And that's excellent for me. But then I want to make sure that if I do that, that people can understand that no matter what, that 
since I understand that kind of fashion over here, I'm not saying there's some big kind of individuality I have to find out over here. And it's more how I need to go and become much more to have a link. And why is that? I realize it's just I realize it's just how it is. I realize that if I have a link online now, I feel that people have to find me. I feel that people have to find who I am. So what I do is I just do door sales for now. I do much more door sales, but I realize that since they never follow me much, I realize that no matter what, I feel over here I'm much more of a blessing. I feel that other people will never want me to succeed and that's why they never want to follow me. I realize now that's much more in my favor because what I do now is I feel because other people never want to follow me much and I feel much more greater success. I feel much more greater success regardless. So I'm understanding that sometimes you have so much great success that other people never want to follow you. And that's what's happening to me. I'm not sure though, now what I do now, because of that, I realize I just go and do door sales all the way. I do door sales all the way and it never concerns me about that. I just do door sales all the way then. And that's it. I say I'm at home, the venue or whatever or whatever. And eventually I go with home bar or marquee or these places and events and I just say, hey, are you guys able to link me up with some links around here to be able to sell myself? And anyway, what happens is they put a link up because they're the venue. And because they're the venue, just ask for them to link you up with a link where people can find them at the event. So with Mounties, it's very different because people at Mounties never care about your link. But at Marquee, they fucking care about your link. I mean, at Home Bar, they care about your link because that's what they promote. Approach it's their link. And they're the ones who link you into it. But if you want to find your own link, approach that's different. Roshi, then you have to go and promote yourself online and you have to go and promote your company and what you are separately with your own link. Roshi, that's different. But if you want to understand how they do it, Roshi, all they do is they link themselves with the actual casino link or home bar link or whatever type of link there is out there. But if I go to the gay club over there, Roshi, it's more on the door sales over here. I'm making sure you understand straight away that no matter what, that all I have to do is book the room and charge at the door and either way that at Melbourne I realize any kind of promotion that happens in Melbourne is just at the door in terms of on the day at the nightclub they're going to say this man is coming in and let's have a look approach that's it approach you everything in Melbourne is like that approach you everything except Sydney approach you Sydney is more hey go and promote yourself as much as you can because in Sydney I can but then also in Melbourne if I arrive one week earlier and I just go and promote myself like this, I can. And now it's also possible for me to do that as well. Where I can go and promote myself on car dashboard somewhere. And I can just go and walk around like this. Brush, it's much more something on the separate, on the side for myself to do. To just increase my name. I brush, that's something different. But making sure anyway that as I go and promote myself in these kind of places, I feel other people want to see me. So I'm making sure anyway that what I do with life coaching is I have to go and do door sales. I have to do door sales only. Prashu, with life coaching, it's always door sales. Prashu, there's no such thing as links with actual life coaching events. Unless you're Tony Robbins, where you're going around the world and you're promoting at one event and you're promoting online ticket sales like that. Prashu, that's different, I love I. But for me to do that, Prashu, it's more about being able to go and travel the world now and be able to go to one place and promote that for one year. And advertise that inside of that event or inside of that place and target it every single year. And after I target it, that individuality or that place and place money into it for the whole year. I love I. Rosh, that's it. Rosh, how much money goes into it? Rosh, I can place around 5000 bucks to have that advertisement going for the whole year. And either way, Rosh, I can target Sydney, for example. I just say Sydney and on Instagram. And $5,000 goes to Instagram. And that way, people show up to my events. I can do that. I can do that way. But what's important for myself now as a life coach is understanding now that as I'm learning about events and where people are, I'm actually going and seeing where, for example, Marlo is going. I want to see where Marlo is going. He's going to different events over here. But to sell out any kind of events where Marlo is going, for example, I want to talk about this. Because when I talk about this, I'm learning. Approach with Marlo, approach he goes to these big events where he's going to fairly big events where it's just him 
and he's inviting people and how does he invite people I've realized now he invites people through links and now how's he doing it bro she's doing it solely for his own crowd bro she he has a fan base that when he places something on a link on his Facebook I promise you people are coming to his events bro she, that's how popular he is about music so that's how it is, but for me to get to that stage, I promise you it's different. I promise you it's different. I have to go and do small events here and there. I have to do small events here and there. I have to go to the Mill Hotel straight away. I have to go to Scary Canary straight away. I have to go to these smaller clubs straight away and pump my music like this. And just pump and pump and pump and DJ and DJ and DJ. And what happens is I build this fan base around myself, but then I book the room as well. I book the room and I charge at the door and make some money. I make some money here and there. And I just promote myself and promote myself and every single time I book Scary Canary or these nightclubs or small nightclubs or big nightclubs around town or around the world, I arrive one week earlier and I fucking promote my business cards all over the fucking car parks over there regardless of what I'm doing, I'm promoting myself. And that's the whole way. And just door sales and door sales and door sales and eventually I build a fan base. I build this fan base of people who have seen me around town with live coaching and everything. And now with life coaching, it's different. But with life coaching around the world, now that's different for me. Russia, for me to life coach around the world, Russia, what I do is I life coach only in Australia, and that's it. I life coach only in Australia and online, and that's it. Russia, I never fucking care about them. But nightclubs is different. I promise you, nightclubs, I have a nice and beautiful road to go everywhere with nightclubs. Russia, nightclubs is all over the place. I see opportunities everywhere. I see opportunities everywhere with actual live coaching and also my nice and beautiful music production. So what I can do with live coaching is I can go and promote myself in Serbia and Balkans over there. I can go to Mostar, I can go to all these places and functions and I can create an events. And what I do with the events over there is I make sure I book the events, I book the parlor and I say, hey, I'm coming on this day, I'll give you the money and guess what they do? Or should they just wait for me? I probably should have to do the promotion here. I have to do the promotion. I mean, how do I promote that? Probably no chance to promote that. I mean, you understand? I mean, either way, probably Nick Vujicic went there, and now he has some customer fan base over there. Probably he has people following him over there, and that's why people did come to see him. I mean, I mean, you understand? But as soon as I understand that Serbia is following me, probably if I make an event over there, probably they're coming straight away to see me. And what do I do from that point? I'm probably I do nothing on promotion other than just doing my online promotion and that's it bro i'll just say i'm coming to this place over here and you can come see me because they already see i'm coming but how do they see i'm coming i'm probably i'm popular and that's it i'm probably and that's the whole point yeah so with life coaching is different but with life coaching i understand that either way with life coaching i just go and do my own thing in daily life i go do some busking performances somewhere i go do a performance here and there around australia once once again my europe papers i can go to united kingdom over there I can go to United Kingdom. I can go all over Europe now. I can go all over Europe. I get my business card. I say, this is where I'm coming. I mean, this is where I'll be. And I'm English or whatever. And guess what? I just do the same thing I'm doing in Australia. I do the same thing I'm doing in Australia. And that's it. I just go around these clubs everywhere. And I just go and pump all my music around Europe. And boom, 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 boom. And there we go. And that's it. I promise you now, if I want to go travel overseas somewhere, I make sure I build events around what my money is and everything. And I make sure I advertise music as much as I can. And I go around music and music and music and music. And my life coaching is here and there on the side somewhere. And people can understand no matter what. They're from my nightclubs. I told them, hey, from this point on that you guys have to understand that no matter what, you can find me at this hotel or this hotel on this day. They just check, I mean, just check out my events. I'm doing my nice and beautiful life coaching events around town here. And then everybody can come to my live events over here. And anyway, I'm just learning to promote myself this way. And I'm focusing on making sure that as I do these events, I can do everything I'm doing in Australia, I can do it overseas somewhere. And now, the thing is, I can do exactly that. I mean, it's all the same thing. It's just different zone, and it's a different country, and it's a different language. But I'm understanding anyway that what's important is I still promote myself regardless. So I'm breaking the barrier over here. And I have no barriers in my life. I have no barriers in my life. So what I want to do also is make sure that I'm planning along the life of what I have. But I'm understanding that no matter what, as a music producer, I want to be able to go around wherever it is 
and promote as much more postage and everything around fences and much more I want to be advertising and placing this money into advertisements on fences and on business cards and cars and also I want to be promoting myself my, I, want, I want to be promoting myself much more around real life and real life promotion and that way people are coming to see me quickly but why they are never promoting me in terms of why they're never following me on Instagram is something big for sure it's something that I feel that they are so jealous of me that they never want to follow me I feel they're so jealous of me that they never understand me and how inspirational I am and because they never understand me for sure they're following me behind the scenes but they're keeping it small on me I mean they're keeping me small in a way that they never want to follow me because I'm so successful